not going anywhere, serpent. Nope. Wow, this is riveting. Um, so... How are you doing? Oh, I can actually... Okay. So... I'm just gonna keep hitting you if you're just gonna keep running like this. Wow. Um... This... Oh, no, 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 no! I was gonna take a screenshot of you because this was, that was just spectacular. But okay. <laughs> Oh god! Oh, oh crap! So yes, these are these are the bazakas, by the way. These are creations of sea. Uh, these are pretty much handmaidens of Guinevere. That sea the that sea the kidnapping. His experiments mutated them into these things. Um, they are a good source of human for hunting humanity. If you wish to get them, if you wish to farm here. Not sure why you would do this, but. I guess later on makes a bit a later point makes a bit more sense, but you can get them more crowded and then less happy for the most part. But yes, we have to deal with them. But also, in these other cells you can actually engage in murder of the engage in murder with the local prisoners. And so really this archive, which you'd think would be a large library of knowledge, is more of a prison for like see to just perform experiments with. See, it's kind of crazy, sadly. But with good reason. Very good reason. That won't be the re I'm not going to be the one to tell you. Because there's going to be someone else who will tell me to tell it for me. If that makes any sense. All crypto nonsense. And it's locked because we cannot open it. There's another key to me, but... And more bazookas! Okay. That's cool. So, let's just kill the... Hey! Crystallized hollow? Mm, nope, don't, you're not gonna hug me, nope. Go away. Leave me alone. Um, but generally these things can actually hold on to you. Black pretty much drop can hold you, and what they can do afterwards is kind of nasty. So I don't want to be the. I don't want to demonstrate what their hugs are. What a hug from them can do. That's because it's painful. And thank you for dying. For Alright, so that's them. Oh my god! Holy crap, that scared me! I did not even know they could do that! I was not even sure. I didn't even know they could do that. Oh my god, it scared, it scared the crap out of me. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, so apparently they can lunge at you at a certain distance. Jeez. This is the extra key, so pretty much this key allows us to open the other cells within this little area for now. And we cannot re we couldn't be able to open it otherwise. Which it has its uses, yeah. And pretty much to finish this off, we gotta turn that thing off. And even so, even if not to get rid of these things, it's also sort of where we need to go as well. Because there's a certain thing we need in order to get out of this prison we have to go over. We just have snake men waiting for us, lovingly.
There are a few, uh, there's a couple more Kazakas. These two will not actually harm you at all, no matter what you do. So I need to kill that one, and I'm gonna move close because I believe this thing wasn't on at least. You can hear it, you can actually hear them crying. These two are handmaidings of Guinevere, most because of the miracles they do drop. Which is Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Basically, you can only use those miracles if you're actually with the co covenant with Guinevere, which is the, I believe, Princess Guard. And, well, here's Mr. Logan. Hello again. What a chance meeting this is. Alas, I'm in prison once again. I don't suppose you could stage me in prison. Such a storehouse of knowledge, so close but just out of reach. The thought offends me so I could simply die. As a student of the arts, you understand me. Yeah. So, Mr. Logan is in uh, bars once again. Uh, as a student. And unfortunately, we do not have the key to open him, to free him out. So, yeah, he's gonna be there for a while, but we'll free him. We'll, we'll free him eventually because we actually need to. Although, I won't lie, I kind of find it funny that the two times you do meet Logan in two different areas, he's actually behind, he's behind bars for some reason, and for the same reasons that it's probably from the seats, the channelers in seat, or the, or the snake man that he's worked with, that's the reasons he's probably behind bars. Yeah, that's just So, I'm gonna kill the snake man first before I do How am I alive? How am I alive? How am I alive? That's not a question, but just freak out. Soul Spear! So powerful! I love it! I'm actually doing some of both because I'm only there to have both of these guys. Huh. So we get the tower giant door key, which unfortunately again does not open this does not free Mr. Logan. However, there's actually a way of getting out. And it shuts, and I'm just shutting that off because it's annoying. And it'll keep and if we ever come back here, which we will eventually. It keeps all the Bazakas nice and contained in there, so we can kill them as we wish, as our to our leisure then. Which is good. Very good. So and so let's continue onwards and Get out of here. Makes me wish there was a fast way to get out there. Get out of here. Go into the dukes. And eventually we get to fight. We'll event there will be a chance we will fight Seath later. And we can actually hurt him, but... Again, I will not tell what that is. Because I want to let Mr. Logan tell us that for us. Because he has he can put it in better terms than I could. And sound more into and sound much more knowledge knowingly about it too, which is kinda cool. <laughs> and the best thing of since I killed those two snake men up there, because normally they will try to run up the ladder, I don't have to fight them at all, so. Clear passage! Bye! <laughs> And a lovely 2100 souls. So good. And we are finally, and we have cleared up the wave. So if we ever die and we or go back here, the way is very simple, thankfully. And we can actually see outside his door, outside seats, like archival domain. There's an archer here at all times, as well as jerks. Mm. 
Yep. Yep. Just hits in the soul. Um. You can't see it, but there's a bunch of crystals out there. That's gonna be where we'll, that's where we're gonna be heading eventually. We'll be heading out there soon. Mm, that hurt so much. That hurt. I'm just gonna run past all the nonsense this time. No records. No dealing with running snake men because I think they're just gonna stay there now. So that's no problem to me. They don't run up here. I don't care. What I do care is that my sorcerers are back, so I can start killing people. A good old fashioned murder. And the only reason I didn't go run up and fight him is because I'd have to be dealing with this clown. And personally, I don't want to deal with this terrible man. Mostly because his sandwich seems to be off the charts and he can just bash me in the shield. Bash me in the soul. But, either way, I'm gonna get ready to kill this man around the corner here. Hello, Chandler of Seath. almost destroyed me. So I'm going to continue onwards. Because this is a play- oh, oh god. This is a speed- this is how you- I'm going to show you how to speed run through the rest of this place basically so you don't longer have to worry about it. Jesus Christ arrow. I think the arch is going to be dead now. This guy will be close to dead but I don't really care. Can't really be bothered to kill him boy, so I'm just going to leave him alone. Let him rot. Because the unique because I'm more focused on the unique ability of rotating stair of rotating stairways. Just because it's just so cool. Okay. So that's almost good. We're almost out. We're all, good news is we're almost done with this part, thankfully. Thank you for, you know. Thank you. I would have loved it more if you were, you know, not in the way. And of course, there is more. there are more channelers of Seath. Of Seath. I believe he's the last Chandler that you can meet. And have to fight. I hit you in the soul! thing about these channelers is they can sort of run away. Oh, why is up there? I don't know. So I'm just gonna redirect. I'm just gonna redirect everything so I can just murder him. I could leave him alone, but you know what? You avoid getting hit in the soul earlier. Something I can't allow. So. Basically, this is going to be this is going to clear up a lot of this is going to be finishing up. So we're almost done. We're almost out. We'll have free roam of the entire area soon. Just killing him off. I only killed him mostly because he's just an, he's just annoying. Going down here. Actually gets us a few new things. <laughs> Okay, that was funny. 
All right, in here is, I believe, oh, blue tie magic. Okay, so that's not what I was thinking. But this is, but this is going to be an important area that I will be visiting a lot. Probably more off screen, so you guys don't have to worry about it. But over in here is a few things we'll need. Um, in here, I think is. Yep, it is the set of the channelers of Mr. Seath the Scalus, which have their own bit of lore to it. And this is the more important part, the giant selkie. Uh, just so I can show up. Just a bit of things, and this gives some insight to Seath as well. Helm of the channeler, sorcerers that serve Seath the Scalus. The six eyes are arranged in two vertical com columns and compensate for Seath's lack of sight. The heaviest of protective gear for sorcerers imbued with ma and imbued with magic. And the robes of the channelers, sorcerers that serve Seath the Scalus. Even after the onset of Seath's madness, the Snatchers, as they were often called, ventured to far lands to find several set human set specimens. So, basically, yeah, these guys are cat kidnappers, kind of crazy, but admittedly, their armor is kind of good and decent, so we can just wear a bit of it. I also just like the leggings and gauntlets for now. They're not going to be the full set, I'm gonna, they're not going to be the weapon I'm going to be wearing. They're not going to be what I'll be wearing in the end, necessarily, just for now. Um, and pulling this switch, it opens the doorway and gets spawn and leads us to the bonfire. And the good thing about this bonfire, it's actually warpable, but I'm not going to rest at it just yet. Mostly because I want to take advantage of the fact that there are no aim that most, that the way to, through the prison is cleared for the most part. I want to take a lot of advantage of. I want to take advantage of that. Oop. Guys, will just stay out of my way. And basically, that way is also cleared up there in the main floor. Hi. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you guys trying to chase me? I'm going to decline on that. Because I don't want you to chase me. You guys are, bast are bastards. Um, I'm going to meet you guys back over to where Logan's cell is. Presumably probably killing the Bazakas as I go. So, yeah. Well, actually, no, I don't have to send apologize really because there's a shortcut actually there's a shortcut I can take to get them there which involves this board these planks it's a funnel actually no this isn't the true shortcut is it uh, where is it? actually no I think this might lead to it though so nope well I effectively caused no I saw nothing doing that Effectively, all I did was kill myself. Yay. So I think I'm just gonna... Where are my souls, actually? Are they up there? They're probably up there. That would make, that would make the most sense, basically. I'll just keep, this, just keep my terrible skirt. Yeah. Okay, I think I see how I died. I think I know why I died. It's that board. Ah. Yeah, that's the problem when you're going down here at least, because you can you can fall off or you can be nudged off. So you just want to angle your thing to the side more than more or less, and you get the maiden set, which kind of uh, can sort of confirms what Seif has been doing most of his life, or I should say has been spending most of his life doing. He's killing people. The problem is, is I don't remember how to do the shortcut to through the archives. Well. Oh well. That's no problem of mine. So I'm just gonna go and murder the snake man again. You 
guys. The lag is so much. I forget about that. Jeez. I'm dead anyway, so it doesn't matter. So, no. Bye. I know there's a way to do, like, get over there, like, in a short. There's, like, a shortcut to do it. I know it's there. And I forget the problem. Can I just close the door? Oh. <laughs> Scumbag. Think about what you did wrong. <laughs> oh, that makes me feel so happy that I remember that. You can close the doors. <laughs> even more so that they can't actually, that they seem to not, they don't even remember how to open the door, them, that they don't know the door is open. Or, you can open the door. Oh, it's so good. Bye! <laughs> so I can effectively just avoid fighting any of these mooks and a half. <laughs> That's pretty good. But yeah, basically there is a shortcut you could have taken that gets you that item and pretty much brings you up there, but I don't want to do that now. Cause I real mostly because I real have the realization that it would force me to fight those three guys again and I really do not want to be bothered with with doing that. So I'm just gonna murder the Bazakas who are all conveniently all in a nice lovely row. Murder row, you might say, even And another thing about the Soul Spear I love, it goes through, it actually kills the enemies. It's so good. Mr. Logan, because I want to actually get him out of here. So, Logan, what do you got to say? Oh, thank you very much. I'm saved. That makes twice. I must be sure to repay you. I will visit the archives. If I discover any new spells, I shall share them with you. Prepare to be impressed by the onward march of sorcery. Yeah, so pretty much, Logan's going to Logan can teach us is going to is going to leave here. He's gonna go back to that one part of the archives I showed you guys, and there's also the Firekeeper Soul with him. But the more important thing is, he can actually, t he's gonna teach us some new sorcery, so yay! New stuff, I'm getting tired of how awkward that looks against me. Though that scare just looks so awkward with the rest of my gear, so I'm just gonna wear my actual set, so... Never mind! I may just do like some weird mix match of all the sorcerer gear I have right later at some other point, but not now. So I'll meet you guys at the actual bonfire in the Dukes. Which will be shortly, so yeah. Bye. I'll see you then. Or did it oh no, crap, that's right. Everything's respawned, so it doesn't matter. Well, that's a thing. That's gonna be a it's gonna derail everything. That's terribly And I think that first. Instead, this is this bonfire, and I think I'm gonna love. Actually, I'm gonna this so I can get my intelligent, intelligence a bit up. I need all the intelligence for what I'm going to be attempting next. Because some of the upgraded source. He's gonna have a lot of sources that are gonna be. that will be a huge upgrade to what we have, and. they're a bit. Dema they demand a lot of intelligence to use, so I'm gonna need all I can get basically. I will be buying them off of him as they go because they're also fairly expensive. <laughs> Which that part is actually very sad but true. So I'll meet you guys at the actual bonfire now for real. So speedrun commence! Yay! Alright, we are back at the actual bonfire. Hooray! <laughs> actually I managed to do that without dying. Amazing. And I think for the first time in a while other than I'm gonna need pop these two souls. I'm gonna actually turn reverse my humanity. My, 
It's going to revert. I'm going to reverse my Halloween and then actually kindle, kindle this bonfire. So I can actually get two extra slots at least because they'll, they'll, be, they'll be helpful. As well as I can pop an extra. It'll allow me to pop an extra level, which is useful, thankfully. Let's go get ourselves. Let's reverse my hum humanity at least, since I got I have the humanity now at least, thankfully. So where did I get the extra? Where did I get the extra humanity? Hmm. Must have gotten now if that's killing people so much. Well, that's interesting. So for the first time in like God knows how long, Voltier is now human again. Yay! I love it. It looks it looks better human. So let's continue onwards. Because our actual destination is not that far off, thankfully. It's rather simple. And there's a phone, if so I do apologize for that sound. And there's Logan, which I'll just Logan show you. Has played his truly magnificent, more than expected. As promised, I shall share the new sorceries with you. And the secret sees immortality. Yeah, so he tells us a bit he pretty much he has the new weapons, the the new spells he gives are the crystal soul spear, soul magic weapon, and the crystal soul homing crystal mass, which their plots are as obvious. Crystals boosted by the knowledge of Logan acquired from the Regal Archives. Firing homing crystal soul mass. The mysteries of soul crystals and the sorceries are deeply intertwined, which is interesting how they throw it. And also, high, high magic plus crystallization, right weapon. R Logan's trials were successful, and the crystal medium facilitated a stronger bond between weapon and soul. And finally, the crystal soul spear. This pa these pale magic spear spears, sharpened by their crystallization, are on par with the armaments of ancient of the ancient lords. So, basically, Hello. what Mr. Logan here has discovered is the power of crystals. Apparently, Hello. with the magic of the soul, his theories of soul of the connection of souls with sorceries have actually effectively st strengthened everything. But ah, this the secret of Seed's immortality. If you were forty and were imprisoned. You must know that the seed is a true remedy, different from other cells. His wounds close promptly, and no mortal blow affects him. Granting true his wounds close promptly, and no mortal blow affects him. Granting true insulation from death. It is an effect of the primordial crystal. A sacred treasure pillaged by seed when he turned upon the ancient dragons. So only by destroying the primordial crystal. So happens. The primordial crystal is in the inner garden of these very archives. The crystal forest. So yes. We've been told pretty much the primordial serpent. Crystal is what he sees the scale is stolen in order to acquire in order to learn the discover the secrets of his of immortality that he was not denied. And generally, while he was researching upon this artifact, he went insane. And in essence got that immortality of his by the time he was dead. And just that did upset the man. He just promptly kicked me in the face as hard as he could. No mimic, you are take the death. Also because you have a weapon, you drop the enchanted, the enchanted fal falcon. And behind this bookshelf to the chest that I ignored earlier is probably the most useless weapon the ember in the world, the crystal ember. But in order to get to the gardens, it's rather fairly simple. All you do is pull the lever right there. And we are inside the forest, the inner gardens of Seath the Scalus. But, it should not be the only thing that is here. Is that thing right here? Hmm. That'll be a 